Now here's the deal. I made a video, what was it, yesterday, about how your girl Lauren Kiki Palmer went and, <laughs> went and decided to go mess the back of her neck up by getting the Queen of Kush tattooed in the back of her neck with some ratchet looking pyramids. Well now, she showed off her new hairdo and it's much, much worse than the tattoo. Much, much worse. I thought that nothing could be worse than that crap. Here's what she had to say <laughs> on Twitter. She said, Y'all be tripping off her thing. Kiki, you can sing. You're a pretty girl. But do you have to ruin everything by going and getting the Willow Smith? What in the world of weird hairdos is that crap on your head? Jamaican on the top and skinhead on the side, just that's just not a hairdo, Jesus. And I'm I'm very much so offended. I mean, don't get me wrong, her whatever that is at the top of her head. It's kind of fleeky, but then the shaving on the sides, you just ruined it all. Why not just get all dreads or whatever those things are called, twists? I don't know, but to have your head shaved like that on the sides and the back, I mean, you just look like a gay bitch from outer space. But anyways, just because I'm not feeling it, just because I think that she looks disgusting like this, just because I personally prefer her to wear a weave in this very rare circumstance, I know, I know, I know, me recommending a hair hat, but wearing some mess like this, no. Just because I'm offended, just because I think that she's trying to troll us, just because I think that she conspired with Willow Smith and Bobby V to ruin my day with terrible hairdos, doesn't mean that you feel the same. And also Chris Light Brown. Chris Light Brown is also a part of the Black Ugly Haircut Alliance, the Buha. That's what I think they are, the B Team Buha, B-U-H-A. I'm about to start a hashtag. But anyways, just because I think that there's a conspiracy going on, doesn't mean that you do. Will she start a fashion trend for 2016 with this ugly-ass hairdo? Or will this be the death of ugly hairdos? And what do you think about the Buha, the Black Ugly Haircut Alliance, or Hairdo Alliance? Do you think that they actually exist? Do you think there's actually an ugly haircut cult? So sort of like ratchet hair illuminati or am i tripping here let me know what you think about team buha below be sure to subscribe to the meat magazine youtube channels visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more follow me on twitter at meat magazine kiki you can't go around singing as good as you do and looking as good as you do and then you come up with a damn video game character from the 80s haircut she looks like the black character that they would put in the video game all fucked up and whatnot because they didn't want them to outshine the white character that's what she looks like Apparently, that's the new style for 2016. That's why Willow Smith walks around anyways. Let me stop. Meet Magazine.